No, we, but we do. We, we have chili. Yes, we do, Sarah. And that chili <laughs> is smelling delicious because it's all part of the Caledonia Chili Cook-Off. It's back and goes uh, is next weekend. So joining us is Mike Zima from the Knights of Columbus. Hello, Mike. Also, the uh, you're the host of the cook-off. And we have competitor Sarah Wilkins from uh, Shelley's Family Dining in... Kohler. Kohler. Represent Kohler. What? what? What's up? <laughs> okay, let's start with you, Mike. Um, so how many years have we been doing it for now? This is our seventh annual Caledonia Chili Cook-Off. Wow. Nice. And this is, uh, we had about a three-year hiatus because of uh, the COVID. Right. But we're glad to be back. And this year we have 24 competitors with their favorite chili dish. Okay. That the public can come and sample. All right, like uh, like Sarah's. Now, do you need any help with this, Sarah? Is there any secret ingredients in your chili? Absolutely, it's made with love. Made with love. Okay, made so then I, so then I can help in. So are we, are just, we just we're, we're just dumping mm -hmm. in. Yep. So you've already so you already had your beef and you were stamping down that beef in, in the break. These I are just some spices and yeah, we've got some chili powder and some paprika, some garlic, some garlic powder. There's pepper and salt and lots of cumin. Oh, lots of cumin. Oh, and yep. then a little bit of a little, bit, little of spice. bit of spice. We got some red pepper flakes. We don't do it too spicy. We just like to make it happy for everybody to enjoy. Is this garlic here too? That you is want, more garlic. Want the garlic in there exactly. too. Now, are you somebody like when you're making your when you're making your chili, like you're making it today, but you're serving it tomorrow? I'm making like... it today, and I'm eating it today, and then it always tastes best the next day. Flavors get to mingle and settle, and it just it's just better the next is day. Is this pork and beans? What is this? Pork and beans. Yes. But it is a tomato and beans. Oh, tomato and beans. Yes. Oh, I love that. All three of these going in there. All three of those bad boys in there. Okay, I'm helping out here. Okay, so what's the what's the cause, um, Mike? Where's uh, where's all the funds going from the chili cook-off? Um, we find families that are in need that have kids Thank you. with require major medical treatments or support, awesome. and they're just having a hard time making ends meet. So we raise money to support those families, and that's one of the main reasons why our event's so successful because it's a small community and the community wants to pull together and help each other out. So all of our food, all of our chili is all donated, similar to Shelly's restaurant. We have 24 entries. Um, we have over $15,000 in prizes that has all been donated. We have financial donations and in exchange for all the donations and support we get, we advertise local businesses like Shelly's Fine Dining and all the other organizations and support groups that help our cause. How do you get selected to be one of the cookers? Um, we call on the public, right. we advertise, this starts in late December, early January as far as planning goes. We have posters, we had adver advertisements, our numbers are out there. Uh, you can reach us at www.caledoniacookoff.ca right. and um, people want to be part of our event. Not only for competing and cooking, but also for prize donations and financial donations and in exchange we advertise their businesses on posters, programs and at the event. And it's built over the years, so this is year number seven. Year number right. seven. When we first started, um, we expected to have maybe a few hundred people. Uh, we ended up having five or six hundred, we raised six thousand dollars. The last year we had this, during COVID, we had to cancel the event just before, uh, the week before it happened, and we ended up raising the most money we ever did, which was forty thousand dollars. What do you, what do you have expectations for this year? Uh, we expect to surpass our last performance. Okay, so so. you want to, because you already have a finished dish there. You Could you serve us up some as we, as we, as we, uh, as we're wrapping up here? So when is it? Let's get to those details. So April twenty second. So that is next Saturday. That's correct. That's from four to eight p.m. in Caledonia at the Riverside Exhibition Center, and uh, the to have your, to enjoy chili. It's eight samples for twenty dollars. There's Prizes, raffle prizes. Uh, there's a grand prize of two tickets anywhere WestJet flies. Um, there's kids area, reptile zoo. There's a six-piece band. Pipe down is the name oh, of the band. Man, there you go. So it's a really big community event that everyone really wants to be part what of. What are some of the awards given to the best? So best chili. So we have right? three judges that will be judging based on best original. There you go. Nice. Best alternative, meaning pork or sorry, um, turkey, chicken, right. or vegan. And then the elusive ring of fire. Oh, ooh. No. Do, you go, do you go for that one? Um, maybe not the next day. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you know what, Sarah, I love how it's liquidy. Yes. You know what I mean? So you can, you can have your bun and you can dip it in there and have a little bit of fun. Okay, yeah, so yeah. it is the seventh annual Caledonia Chili Cook-Off. Don't miss it. Next Saturday. Absolutely oh, worth the drive. Sarah. Mm, Isn't it good? Very good. Thank very you. Good. 24 to choose from. You can't go wrong.